In this short video, we're going to show you how to update your Roots Magic to the latest version. Now, there's actually two different terms you may hear. One is upgrade, and the other is update. And we're going to talk about updating. Now, upgrading is when we release a new major release. So in other words, if we go from version 4 to 5, or from version 5 to 6, or 6 to 7, those are called upgrades. And those are where we add a lot of new big major features to the program. And those upgrades are ones where you would go and order at a discount the latest updated major version of the program. On the other hand, updates are smaller, minor updates that we release, and these are completely free for the current version. So in other words, if we're, you're working with version 6 point whatever, if we release a newer version of version 6, that was considered an update and it will be free. So let's just go ahead and show you. Now there's three ways that you can update your program right from inside of Roots Magic. The first is when you start the program up, when you run Roots Magic, if there's an update available, the Roots Magic News screen will pop up and there'll be a green bar right here that says an update to Roots Magic is now available. And you can click on install the update and that will start you right into updating the program. On the other hand, if you'd like to see what has changed, you can click this more info button and that will take you to a web page that will list what changes, what fixes, what new little features we may have added in that update so that you can look and see what has changed before you actually go ahead and install the update. So that's the first place. The second place, if you go ahead and close this, is when you're running the program, if there's an update available, down here in the lower right corner, you'll see a little notification that an update is available. And if you click on that, that will also come up and have the same two options, download and install the update or learn about this update. And the third way is to go to the help menu and you can click on help and say check for updates and that will again bring up that same screen to download the update or to learn about the update. Now keep in mind that these uh, updates require you to be connected to the internet because they go and they download this update off of the internet. Now if your computer is not connected to the internet, we're going to show you another way in a little in a second uh, how you can actually get these updates. But let's go ahead and show you how to do an update. So the first thing, if I tell it I want to go ahead and download and install the update, Roots Magic is going to download that update and it's going to show you how big the actual update is and how much how how much is transferred so far and it's going to show you the progress and then it's going to say that the program needs to close so that it can actually install the update so I'm going to go ahead and click OK and Roots Magic it's going to bring up the setup menu it's going through and um, going through the install and now when Roots Magic brings up this news screen, you'll see that the little green bar is not there anymore. And that's because we are using the latest version. So if the news comes up and you don't see that little green bar or you don't see the little notification down here in the lower right corner, that means one of two things. One, either you are using the latest version of that, of that particular major version or you're not connected to the internet. Uh, and actually, if you're not connected to the internet, this may actually give you a notice that it actually can't connect to find out if there's an update. Okay, so if you ever want to see what version you are actually using, you actually want to see the actual version number, what you can do is click on Help, and then go down here to About Roots Magic, and that right there is going to show you the actual version number that you're running. It'll also show you the folder where Roots Magic is installed as well. Okay, so let, I mentioned that we're going to show you another way. And what you're going to do, this is, this is useful if that automatic update doesn't work for some reason, or if you are uh, running Roots Magic on a computer that's not connected to the internet. So if that's the case, you will actually have to be connected to the internet 
in order to do this, but this allows you to do it from a friend's house or from a library or whatever. What you're going to do is on a computer that is connected to the internet, you're going to go to rootsmagic.com, you're going to go to our website, and you're going to, on the menu, you're going to go to downloads and then software updates. When you click on that, we have updates for our various programs and you're going to be interested in the one for Roots Magic. So you're going to click on that and you can click right here to download the actual update installer. And if you are on a, like I say, if your computer is not connected to the internet, you can go to someone else's house that is uh, uh, connected to the internet or to the library and you can click on this and download this installer file onto a flash drive which you can then take home, plug in that flash drive, and run that update installer from your flash drive, and it will update Roots Magic on your computer to the latest version without you having to be connected to the internet. Okay, there's also this other file, the Place Database Installer. You may want to download that. Um, if you've already got Roots Magic installed, though, you don't need to download this because it will have been installed the first time that you actually install the program and and you don't really need this unless this database place database has changed which it hasn't in in quite a while so that is how to update your version of roots magic to the latest version